Hello folks, Odd here with your evening earthquake update. It is 7.05 UTC on April 3rd, 2013. Got a lot to go over today on earthquake news and on the earthquake watch, so bear with me on this one. We have a 4.6 that just popped off down here in South America. We had a 4.9 in the Atlantic Ridge. We also had a 4.5 and a 4.2 over there in the Mideast. We also had a 2.8 and a 2.7 in the central US around Arkansas and Missouri also 2.5 over here in Cali still having three points and two point swarms over here in the Virgin Islands Jamaica um, Puerto Rico and Haiti area so let's take caution to that also down here the 4.7 4.2 with this 4.6 in South America so like I was saying here you know folks you know please be safe you know we had a pretty good amount of quakes pop off we had a 5.0 off the coast of Japan, 5.4 in Myanmar, another 4.8 and a 5.2 down here in Indonesia as well. As you can see, you know, just a lot of stuff going on here, folks. So, you know, just take heed, pay attention to all this, please. You know, because it's, it's about to get rough. So here we go. I'm going to show you what it looks like for the past week. And as you can see, right over here in the Virgin Islands area where Jamaica and all that is, huge three-point swarm all week Let's definitely pay attention to that also the 5.3 and a 4.7 and a 4.4 that popped off over here in Iceland is extremely uncommon we had a six-pointer that popped off over here of course off the coast of Japan with a 5.1, 5.2, 4.6, 4.7, 4.7 uh, 4.4, 5.0 and another 5.0 another 4.6 another 5.4, 5.6, 5.4, 5.0, 5.6 you know, just a lot of five pointers, a few six pointers popping off, another five pointer, five pointer. You know, even down here, we had a 5.6, you no know, 5.2, a 5.8, another 5.5, another five pointer over here. So here we go, folks. You know, Earthquake Watch is definitely up and going after we got hit with that cosmic ray burst last week. Some really fishy stuff's been going on. You know, I've been watching been watching earthquakes now for the past two and a half close to three years you know and um, during the whole uh, event that we had in um, Japan a few years ago there was little bits of earthquake swarms going on around uh, Hawaii at that time very minor ones so definitely definitely take caution anywhere around the ring of fire also around the new Madrid fault because there seems to be an uptick there you know, we also had that five-pointer over here in California. So, you know, please, you know, be safe. You know, just, you know, just use caution with all this. All right, so here we go. I'm going to go on to the planetary alignment news. It says, one very strong planetary alignment, Earth, Sun, Venus, and Mars, supported by two other alignments, Mercury, Sun, Jupiter, and Mercury, Mars, Saturn, fall during this time frame with an added influence including the asteroid series astrological aspects involving Pluto indicate a particular or, or potential for a 7.5 magnitude earthquake yeah I'm calling I'm calling seven or higher on this because we also got a coronal hole stream that's going to be popping in and affecting earth during this April 5th April 6th earthquake watch that's why I'm calling it till the 10th um, we also have a uh, you know, just just all kinds of stuff going on here on, you know, the space weather prediction site. You know, just look at this. You know, they didn't even block it out. I mean, they still have like little splotches over here. You know, they're trying to cover it saying that it's under repair. There must be something really crazy going on with the neutron monitors. You know, have you guys ever seen the movie 2012? When the conspiracy theorist guy is talking about neutrinos, you know, he's shooting little bullets out of an orange, talking about Earth crust displacement. Well, think about this. You know, we just got hit with a huge cosmic ray burst. You know, planetary alignment's coming up, coronal hole stream's coming up. You know, I'm calling for a massive earthquake somewhere on the Earth within the next few weeks, you know, the next week or so. You know, just definitely take heed to this because as you can see, the cosmic ray density spiked up over to 10,000 and then it just cut off. You know, and you can definitely tell it's all covered up here. So, you know, like I said, folks, you know, you need to stay safe. You know, I mean, just 
it's just crazy you know from the 25th or the 27th when it hit I mean you could just see 3% gain okay you know it's just oh man it's just I don't know just all kinds of stuff going on folks you know even the muons are acting acting weird you know so just you know take take my advice take heed as you can see we're still getting penetration so definitely you know just be safe you know it's better safe than sorry in my opinion so there it is folks that is your earthquake update you know like I said please stay safe much love and may God bless you all I will come back on if we get struck with any big quakes just to let you guys know about it you know also around the Canary Islands you know they had another 4.7 pop off today which is not reading on the maps why I don't know some people are calling harp interference but I don't know I guess we'll see you know because if that thing pops off you know huge tidal waves so like I said you know just please stay safe uh, just get prepared you no know, it doesn't hurt to be prepared like always much love and may God bless you all